What's everybody, it's Boykubi here. Welcome to Robocop Rogue City. This is a demo of the game. As you can see down here. I don't know really much about this game. I don't know like where it's set. I haven't even seen the movie. Which is criminal of me. But whatever, I'm going to play. Uh, new campaign. We'll do normal. Select. You give us three minutes, and we give you the world. Good evening. I'm Casey Wong. A military submarine that went missing over three years ago has suddenly reappeared in the Baltic Sea. Confused seamen mistakenly opened fire on the last Lapland reservation, killing 12. Thankfully, our homesick sailors are back on U.S. soil. Welcome back, boys. In local news, a new crime wave that is sweeping Detroit has already claimed the lives of 21 police officers. Here's a statement from the head of OCP, Omni Consumer Products, that's funding and running the Detroit Police Department. Old Detroit has a cancer, and that cancer is crime. It must be cut out, and OCP holds the scalpel. According to our sources, the attacks were aimed at catching the attention of a man whose identity remains unknown. This dangerous new guy in town seems to have his eye on doing business in old Detroit. Your fussy hands off me. Shut I'm sorry. Uh, there seems to be a, a, a... Disturbance? I'm a big fan. Now move! Don't adjust your television sets. Your regularly scheduled program will be back shortly. Now, this message goes out to the new guy in town. It seems that you're looking to spend some money in this great city of ours. I'm here to tell you that the Torchheads are open for business. You may have heard of us as the number one supplier of nuke in old Detroit. The most potent, addictive drug available in front of every convenience store, school, or library near you. But that's not all we're capable of. Let's get you up here. We'll uh, get Officer... Officer Howard to illustrate the point. You see, Officer Howard made a drug bust that cost us a lot of money. We want to reward this dutiful officer with a performance bonus. A lifetime supply of nuke. Oh, man, you're gonna have the time of your life. There you go. Enjoy. New guy, us torchheads are more than capable of doing whatever you need done in our city. So what is it, huh? Arson, smuggling, drug dealing, good old-fashioned murder. We do it all. You've got the money. We've got the power. So let's talk. There he is. Mr. Robocop himself. Good to see you, Murphy. Lieutenant's at the main entrance to the TV station. Okay, thank you. The ground's oh, pretty cat. Judgment day is here. It is I only, man. That's why the ground's shaky. Where's Puddy Cat gone? Puddy. Can I crouch? No, I don't think so. Okay. Hey, handsome. We're here for the show. Go oh. Him, oh. Thank you. Right. They, they came out of the trucks and they, they just started shooting at anything that moved. I can see your lady is still quite shaken up. I'll get one of the paramedics to check on her. Oh, don't, don't bother. She's only Jones. Okay. 
I wouldn't bother. I already ran the plates. You should know by now, when it comes to evidence, we're hoarders. Yeah, they gunned down everyone here. If it keeps on like this, we're gonna run short of body bags. I will do my job to make sure that doesn't happen. Oh, officer down. I'm gonna give you 10 milligrams of diazepam to make you comfortable. What's going on? I heard a bit of a commotion going on up here. have a ton of hostages but sir under that over and out what is the situation goddamn OCP tells us to stand down till SWAT arrives that's our situation looks like I'm on the way out not so fast buddy who do you think is gonna clean up this place I'm not letting you off that easily you sound just like my wife if that's the case let's get you patched up we wouldn't want to get on her bad side. Press here. Medic! There you are, partner. Lewis. The hell is going on up there? Sorry, dude! The police want us to release the hostages! I so no hard feelings! Hey! You, you can't go in yet! We need to wait for the reinforcements! Reinforcements have arrived. I knew you'd say something like that. We need to find another way. It is too dangerous to cross. For me. But you can take the heat. Go. I'll figure something out. Besides, you could do with a head start. Go on. I've got a signet ring. How much do you think I can get for it? Is it gold? It was taken off someone famous. Just look at him. He looks kind of familiar. <laughs> Guys, guys, we've got company. Anyone expecting a silver freak? Ooh. Drop it, scum. Yes, you scum. Drop it. Oh. Oh. Hey. You do not shoot me. These guys just have pistols, okay. Stay down. Uh, okay. Oh, 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 what's this, what's this? Give me that. Yeah. I heard someone else over here. Unless it was that. The evacuation. Oh, God, where? There. Okay. Okay, got him. Got him, too. Alright, go, 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 go. Oh, ammo. Yes. Oh, hello? Who's that? I don't know. You. There's so many. He's behind him. Oh my. Okay, well, he blew up. Holy shit. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. Oh god. Oh god. Okay, I got four bullets. That was enough. Stop moving! Okay, okay, okay. That was awful aiming for me. Ooh! Nice. Give me that. Okay. Okay, I can run. That's very good. Call the elevator. 200 pounds? What? 2,000, I mean. Worried about the weight limit? Lewis, you're here. We need to get these elevators back online. The service box is in the basement. Let me... 
I doubt you had time between all the heroics, but I got a key card from the janitor. It's good to do some real street work from time to time, you know. After you. Thank you, ma'am. They sabotage the elevators and staircase too. They obviously don't want to be disturbed. Okay. Okay. I can press one and two to swap weapons as well. Ooh, what's this? Stolen wallet, mine. There's crime evidence. Uh, okay, we'll look around for evidence. If there's more. That graffiti is fresh. I bet some of those idiots are still here. In program, what? Heal myself. Ooh. Let's have a look. Ooh, more evidence. Nuke evidence. Ooh, no bueno, fellas. Watch out, motherfucker. Oh. Precision. Any more tricks up your sleeve? What a warm welcome, don't you think? Very warm welcome. Uh, nuke. Hold up. I'm looting. Don't shoot just yet. Alright, who are we shooting at? Will you kill him? Okay. Oh, hello. Oh, you're there. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, can't go that way. Oh. Okay, I don't even know where that fire extinguisher went. Why am I awful at aiming? But I need to. Oh my. What the fuck? A bastard. Uh, okay. Is there anything over here? Uh, money. Uh, I don't see anything else. Okay. Go on. Oh, hello. Are you alive? Nuke. Um. Uh, hello, can I have a look at you? No, I don't think so. I can't look at him. Won't let me. So is there something missing? I don't know. Well, thank you, Sharp. Let's have a look in here. Recovery charge. What are those? Is that my health? It is. Okay, so recovery charge is my health. It's good to know. It is very good to know. Bitch. Wait. <gasps> oh, I took off her fucking head. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. My aim. My aim. What the f <laughs> Okay. My aim is awful. My aiming is awful. Punk deal with it. I don't know. Ah! Run. Okay. I did not expect such a big crowd. Oh, it's a lot bigger than I thought. A lot bigger. Hello. Oh, I thought she was an enemy. Well, lad, how is it going? You well? Stolen wallet. Um. Okay, I can't jump. I mean, to be fair, I'm, I'm like a million pounds. Uh, you know what? Let's heal and take that. Um, do 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 do. Don't see anything. Let's have a look at here very quickly. Nothing. I don't see. Okay. Which way are we going? That way. Yep. Okay. Go, 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 go. Oh, God. Okay, he's dead. Uh, come on. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I'm good. I'm a good. I'm alive. I'm good. Where's this one going? How do I... Bro, there. Oh, that's why. They had, like, a helmet on. No. Oh. Any more? I don't see any more. Um, okay. I probably have a gun. I guess there's no more. Okay. 
the evidence. It's that service box, isn't it? Hey, why don't you check Ooh. it out? Assault rifle. Okay, is my name Murphy? I don't know. Right. It's going over here then. Store power. Oh. Objects investigation. You can use Robocop's vision to investigate objects or people to find clues. Investigate objects are marked with a question mark. Press right uh, click while looking at a question mark to investigate items. Them. Okay. So you're fucking telling me I don't know the other guy. I am detecting a short circuit. We need to isolate the cables. I think I've got something just for that. You are very resourceful. Thanks, but I'd say it was a team effort. They're holding everyone in the studio. It's on the 30th floor. decided to join our glamorous show. I'm afraid you're too late for my autograph. Chopper's ready. I've got to go, but the party goes on. Guys, make sure you provide all our guests with a decent amount of amusement, so don't skimp on the nuke. See ya. What a freaking psycho. We need to be quick before they kill anyone else. I know that look, Murphy. You saw something, didn't you? We are here to enforce the law, Lewis. Let us stay focused. Right. Just keep in mind that I'm here if you need me, partner. What was that reflection? Or who was that in the TV? Slime bags detected. Just look at that, boys! The police dog and its bitch! Not sure which one is which! <laughs> You're gonna take that back! You fucked up, buddy. Ah! Hello. Okay, bye bye. Ooh. Okay. Um, is there anything else? Big ID, stolen handbag. Jeez, I'm finding a lot of evidence. What am I doing there now? Okay. Check out this room. Nuke. Oh. W whoa. Object. Oh, okay. I got a fucking TV now. Someone's getting fucked up. I want to fuck at least one person up with this shit. Ah, damn it. Oh, I'm looking for nuke or evidence. What the fuck happened there? Hang on, very quickly, very quickly. Okay, I'm gonna heal and take that. Okay. You're dead. Grenade. Jesus. Um. Ah, god damn it. I blew up. What? Stop shooting me. Hello. No, give me the TV. Give me the TV. Bitch. God damn it. Hang on. Oh, he died. Nice. Yep. Throwing TVs at people. God oh, damn it. Okay, I only have 11 bullets. I only have 11 bullets. God oh, damn it. Okay. Okay. Yeah, he had a helmet. He had a helmet. Uh. Can I. Okay, there we go. That was weird. Um. Yep. Yeah. Oh, give me that. Hello. Stop it. Oh, what the hell? Oh, okay, I can't see. Fuck. Get out of here. Oh. 
No, and is there a win? No, there is not. Shut up. I was looking for a window. Jump out of. The hell? Okay, I don't know what happened there. Punk Almost power. There. Ugh. Open. It's locked. Hostage situation. When you face criminals who have taken hostages, you have only a few seconds to eliminate the threat and protect the innocent. Use your extraordinary reflexes to meet this challenge. I don't have that good reflexes now. Okay, breach it is. Okay, okay, boom. Boom. Uh, boom. No! Yes! Yes! Thank God you've come! This lady really needs to see a doctor. Murphy, these people need help. Why don't you go ahead? I'll stay with them. Right. This is it, it says something different. Rescued three hostages, one with a gunshot wound to the abdomen, requesting urgent medical assistance. Over. Did I shoot that guy's foot off, by the way, in a slow motion sequence? I might have. Okay. Um, ooh, how much health do I got? I don't know. Can I take it? Nope. Okay, go, go, go. Okay, let's reload this. And swap back to this, you know? No. Is there any more evidence? I don't see anything. Anything in here? Don't see nothing. Oh. Oh! Bitch! God damn! Oh my god! Bitch! Come on. Okay, okay. Give me that, give me that. Bitch! Oh my god! I threw it myself, pretty much. Hi! Fuck! Ah! Oh god. Oh my god, okay, 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 okay. Can you stop shooting me? I'll be dandy. Oh god. Okay, shoot his helmet off. Okay, shoot their heads off. Okay, is that good? It seems good. Let's heal. Because that's all that. Um, Is this something? I don't think so. Wait, what? Why is it showing me that? That's why. <laughs> okay, let's go off um, this way. Give me that. Okay, okay. I want a good throw. I want a good throw because every throw I've done is awful. There we go. That was a great th Fuck you! Peek your head! Okay. There we go, there we go. Is that everyone there? Uh, should be, uh... Alright, bro. You know what? Do that, bitch. Oh my god. Oh my god, okay. God, oh god. Jesus! There you are. Okay, okay, okay. Where are you? There. Oh. How am I still alive? Alright, bro, where are you? Bitch! Is there any more evidence? Um. Okay, that's just that's a big loop. I don't think there was any evidence behind me. Okay, I think I'm good. I'm good to progress. Um, over this side. Is there anything in here? Ooh, stuff. Okay, that's that. Ah. <sighs> Is there anything else? Um, okay, keep going. Oh, 
Hello. Oh, my screen's broken now. Darling, could you get the napkins from the cupboard? Uh oh. Sure thing, Mom. What do we have? Uh oh. It's a surprise. Little man, have you washed your hands? Do I really have to? I wasn't playing in the dirt. Of course you do. No more discussion, Alex. Oh, jeez. Where am I? What do you think about the color of this dress? Oh. I'm not sure if I like the pattern. Where am I going? Teleporting. James really looks up to you. He said in school that he wants to be a police officer just like his dad. He's coming! It's your fault, though! Hello, everyone. It is I, Cup Man. Stop it! There we go. Is that everyone? I think that's everyone yet. Yeah. Right. Hey! No sudden moves, cop! I'm not dying here! Get me another one of those choppers! Like the one that took soot! You hear me? You work so hard, honey. Why don't you take some leave? We all could use a little break from this reality, don't you think? Wakey, wakey! I'm talking to you, shiny! Stand back from that door, or I'll shoot her! I swear to nuke! I don't know what I would do if I ever lost you. You've got three seconds! Three! Our family is the only thing I need to be happy. Two! Are you fucking deaf? Promise me, we will stay like this forever. One! Last chance, weirdo! I love you so much, Alex. Oh. You okay there, Murphy? at once get it away from me i am sorry can you see it's unstable ma'am please calm down it's been a very tough evening and i assure you that everyone wants to be back home with their families though for some of us the night has just begun my bail now. Cash? No problem. Do you take singles? Get back in line. They're here. Good job, Murphy. I think you're forgetting someone. Officer Lewis, you were remarkable. Soot ran off with his tail between his legs. Would have been nice if we caught him, though. All right, all right. Are you done with this circle jerk, huh? Good. We've got a problem. The malfunction caught on camera provokes a question. Can we put our safety into the hands of a machine? Especially one as unreliable as Robocop. We asked Max Becker, the head of security concepts at OCP. Now quiet! We would never put a defective product on the streets. That's not what we do. We all saw it hesitate in a life and death situation. Why? Does it really know right from wrong? Listen, I would trust this guy with my kids. 
I mean, if I had any. This was just an isolated glitch. Thank you. Mr. Becker, I I've got more questions. I just want to snap her little neck. But she's got a point. This was not an isolated incident. It's a pattern. A pattern that the old man wants examined and fixed. Time to see what's hiding in that metal head of yours. We know what's in Murphy's head. It's what's in yours that worries us. Push me, and you might just find out. You, follow me. Oh, okay. Everyone is dismissed. And Lewis, I need your report on the TV station incident. On the double. Um. Ooh. Bye bye. It's bathrooms. Where's the showers going off? Oh right, okay. Um, Damn it! When will this be fixed? Don't hold your breath. OCP isn't looking to spend a dime on our equipment. Okay. Well, hold up. Okay, yes. Let's get. Let's do this. Let's do this. Seems like I do multiple missions actually. What seems to be the problem? <sighs> My damn locker won't open. Can you try? Sure. Wait, what is all this shit doing in my locker? <laughs> we wanted you to be safe out there. Yeah, you guys, very fun. Ooh, can I take any? No, okay. Uh, how you doing, lad? How you doing? Um, uh, okay. There's my favorite walking, talking law enforcement machine. Okay, I lied. Let's get on with it. Why don't you take a seat for me? That's a nasty scar. I'd like to see the other guy. Am I right? You do not. Trust me. Don't mind me. I'll just get this off. So, here's the deal, Robo. The old man is not happy with your performance. Instead of sending you to the scrapyard, as I suggested, he wants to fix you. Hey, pretty boy. You sure know how to make an impression on the ladies. Doesn't it? Hurt him? Hurt? Lady, he's a machine. He's legally dead. We can do whatever we want with him. No, madam. It does not hurt me physically. So we're going to equip you with a little monitoring chip. It will do a real-time check of your system so we can get to the bottom of what the hell is wrong with you. From now on, your performance will be monitored and graded. So better be on your best behavior, huh? Man, better watch his mouth. Let's see what we have here. All oh, right, we're fixing Robocop, or what's the story? Um, okay. Um, ooh, C. Wow. Wow. Skills. Each time you achieve a new level, you receive a skill point that can be used to develop your skills. Developing skills allows you to increase efficiency, obtain unique perks, and unlock favorable dialogue options. Press K to open skill screen, okay? You want me to do this? Um, okay, there we go. Yes, save. Well... I can already see some unwanted activity in your hippocampus. We'll have to keep an eye on it. Other than that, everything seems to be installed correctly. To be sure, let's make a simple test to check that all circuits are in order. What are your prime directives? Serve the public trust. Protect the innocent. 
uphold the law. Okay, nothing disturbed. However, like with any new upgrade, I recommend visiting the range to check if you need calibration. Is that everything? Actually, no. Doctor? Oh, yes, sorry. Uh, my name is Dr. Olivia Blanche. I'm a police psychologist. I specialize in dealing with police officers suffering from emotional trauma. Emotional trauma? Might as well talk to the microwave. It hasn't been working properly either. OCP wanted to see if you'd be willing to have a talk with me as part of your evaluation. I noticed that a great deal of care has been put into making sure that your mechanical components work. However, one aspect of your composition that has been severely neglected is your human side, your brain. I agree. If it was up to me, I'd remove it altogether. What do you think, Doctor? Would save us a lot of hassle. I don't mind the hassle. So what do you say, officer? Is that possibly something that could be of interest to you? I am not sure. Robo, Reed wants everyone in the briefing room in five. It's about the new guy. Excuse me, Dr. Blanche, but I am needed elsewhere. Uh, but we... Okay. Well, can't say we didn't try. Fuck you. Everyone get back to whatever the fuck you usually do around here. Fuck you. I hate him already. Okay. Uh, report to the shooting range. Okay, where is the shooting range? Crazy in that TV station. Good job you had Murphy in with you. You bet. Without him, we'd all be goners. Damn right. Well, lad. How the hell do I get down below me? Ah. Please help me out here. Okay, what's going on? What seems to be the problem, officer? Reed is in the briefing room, and I have my hands full. There are so many complaints filing in that I can't keep up. It's getting crazy in here. Could you open up another line and help me? I am here to serve the public trust. Take the spot on the podium. You're a lifesaver, Robo. A podium. Send you on the counter. Okay. Open a loon line. This line is open. Please form an orderly queue. Officer, I have a problem. My neighbors are hostile toward me. I think it's because they're jealous of my new dog. Why would they get so worked up every time I take him for a walk? What is his name? He has a beautiful red coat, so I call him Fire. He likes to hide, so sometimes I have to yell, Fire! Fire! To find him. Anyway, can you do something about my neighbors? Uh, Your this behavior one. disrupts public order. I must issue a ticket. That's fine. I don't mind paying the price of having the cutest dog in all of Detroit. Next, please. I got something for you, officer. I know where you can find a wanted criminal. That poster over there says there's a reward for that information. And I want it. I want details. Are you blind? I'm the guy from that poster, so... Here I am. Now, give me the money. I will have to detain you. Fine, but... I still get the reward, right? You can hope for a reduced sentence. You can hope for a reduced sentence. Uh, that's not the reward I was hoping for, but I'll take it. It'll be good to get back to jail. Life as a free man can be tiring. What? Take him away. Next, please. Officer, Hi, ma'am. I would like to report my son missing. How old is he? He's 24, but he's never been gone for so long without letting me know. How long has it been? Just over two days now. We do not consider an adult missing within 72 hours. Oh, please, I'm begging you. Something's not right. You really need to find him. Provide me with details. What is his name and address? George Elkins, 7706 Orchard Avenue. 
Let me check. Your son was found dead two hours ago. What? Oh, no. <gasps> oh. Thanks for the help, Murphy. I don't know if that was good help. Damn. What is the guy from the poster? 2000. Nice, no, there's no reason to look at it. He's he's in jail. Oh, I just can't do it. There is no way. Wait, Murphy, what's Would you give me a hand? What's going on? I can deal with blood, guts, but puke is a no-go for me. What? I'll be a sport and move his ass to the drunk tank for me. You've got your special gloves and extra protection, so you shouldn't mind. Hi, right, fella. Come here. Just take him downstairs. I owe you one, Murphy. Oh, no. <sighs> the smell is following you. I'm gonna be sick. Well, no shit, it's following me. I don't remember getting on a, a roller coaster. <laughs> right, junkie. You're going... Murphy. No, not there. Shut up, not yet. Look who's back home. Just toss him in one of the empty cells. No problem. Go on, lad. Ah, uh, finally. Home. Yeah, I'm glad you're Sleep home. Tight. Robo pig! Why do you have to spoil our fun all the time? You metal freak! I'm not the one behind bars, bitch. What up, dickhead? What up, dickhead? Oh, that's the guy we just arrested. Uh, you stupid as well. Okay. Let's, uh, yeah, let's go in for his shooting range. Okay. Score at least 50 points. Okay. One. Okay, okay. Is headshots giving me more points? Probably. I don't know. Two. Why did it just say two on my screen? Was that like wave two? Unless you can try to break the record. What's the record? I don't know what the record is. Okay. Hey. Come on. Okay. Reload. There we go. Come on. I don't know what the record is. Okay. Four. Okay. Oh, shit. Now that's moving fast. Oh god. Damn it. Good job. I'll let the eggheads know that you're good to go. See you in the briefing. What's the record? I don't know what the record is. Is that just my record? Daily highest score, Robocop. Uh, that I'm the best. So, what's on today's agenda? The agenda is that you sit your ass down and listen. Huh. All right, let's go on in here. Oh, there we go. It's no secret that crime has been on the rise ever since what the media has named the new guy in town showed up in the city. The word on the street is that he wants to spend a lot of money in old Detroit, and that has made every gang in the city start advertising their services. We need to find him before things get out of control. Where do we look? Our best bet is to see if he made contact with the torch heads. Robo, I want you to start by checking the arcade downtown. It's become a high activity area for punks. Understood. Everyone else, keep your eyes open. Any questions? Any word on Briggs? What happened to Briggs? He's been missing since yesterday. Shit. Officer Briggs remains missing. That's over 24 hours since he's been in contact with anyone here. Are the two cases connected? No reason to assume so. 
But if anyone finds Briggs' informant, we might learn something new. All right, now get out there. Yes, sir. Wait. You go ahead, partner. I need to write this report. And there's something else I need to do first. Can I take her keys? No? Okay. You enjoy writing your report. I'm going downstairs again. Leave the precinct. Okay. Um. Cruiser's ready for you, Robo. Go get him. Thank you, sir. Right. Let's leave. Bye bye. Yes, I want to leave. Can I drive? City, didn't you? I did too. No. Easier to burn it all, all to the ground. Believe me, just burn it all. All right. Whatever you think. You enjoy game. Sick man. Uh oh. Uh oh. There's a scene. There's a crime scene over here. Where it's just cops. Well, lads, how's it going? Oh, you arrested someone. Hey, Robo, can you help me out here? Sure. A man, pig. Why make such a big deal? How can I assist you, officer? I'm trying to catch this one shifty dealer. This guy steals nuke from other pushers to sell it at half price. This dope head buys from him but won't tell me his whereabouts. I don't know any dealer. You were carrying for three different pushers, so you either like to walk for miles to buy nuke, or you appreciate a discount. Don't take it out on me, because the guy broke your nose? As you can see, he doesn't want to cooperate. I'll make him cooperate. Do not worry. According to my directives, there are several ways to convince him to cooperate. Uh, I ain't gonna let it reprogram my brain. We can talk, but don't let it drill into my head, okay? The guy's name's Maurice, but I don't know where to find him. I always arrange a place over a payphone. I'll give you the number. Let's hope it works. The dealer knows where the others hide their stash. We could collect nuke from the whole neighborhood if we get to him. I will take care of it. But you need to find a payphone first. Try near the supermarket. I think at least one of them hasn't been smashed by vandals yet. Supermarket. Where? Park and phone booth. This way. It's going through the alley. Okay. Is this the supermarket? Hey, I'll learn less if you hang around here. Oh, fuck you. There's um missing children. Um Okay. There's a load of missing people. Oh. Tutorial system issuing tickets. As a police officer, you can issue tickets for misdemeanors like public drinking or disorderly conduct or traffic violations. Hold oh, okay. You What is that? Oil spillage. Ticket! One that likes swimming in oil surely must be swimming in money. Also, whore. You, 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 you're. I know what you are. You like to make money. Illegally ways. You people, ticket. You guys Mike was driving and we heard what we thought was a blown tire, but it was just a gunshot. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's better. Payphone, payphone, payphone. Where is payphone? <laughs> and she takes off her top and says, Hey, this is a private conversation, pig. Okay. Cow. Uh, payphone, payphone, payphone. He threw a gun. Ask me for money. Only a moron steals from a beggar. That's what I said. But then he started shooting. Hmm. 
Oh. Okay, I'll have a look at that in a second. I'm looking for a payphone. Hello. He's my favorite TV star. <laughs> Thanks to you, Kurtz finally had a reason to watch something other than the fast food channel. Just doing my duty. I was merely doing my duty. That kind of hostile situation is not the only thing I can resolve. Can you tell me what happened here? Nasty murder. The victim is a white female, mid 20s. Identified as Casey Carmel. Had a history of petty crime and prostitution, but uh, believe it or not, that's her real name. Any leads? The case is closed. OCP won't spend a single dime on the murder of a prostitute. Cost optimization. Fancy name for we don't give a shit about poor people. So if you were to look around the crime scene, you would potentially be exposing OCP to extra costs. <laughs> if you want to do that, be our guest. Is that homeless man involved? Or... Is that homeless okay. man considered a suspect? Nah, we know the guy. You can rule him out. The guy's a loon. A mental patient. He thinks that aliens dumped the body here. Talk to him if you want. Uh, <laughs> just prepare to hear a tall tale about green people. Oh, no. Uh, what do you think about the murder? Do you have any thoughts about that murder? I bet the girl was killed somewhere else, uh, and the body was only dumped here. And we got the tire tracks, drag marks, uh, if we find a car that matches, we'll find our perp. Yeah, I guess the perp had his hands covered in some green-blue guacamole-ish goo, and the body's covered in it. Why does it always come back to food with you? Anyway, we need to do a proper analysis. The best way to cut the costs of policing is to cut the criminals down. Tell me about it. I didn't join the force to pick up dead bodies off the street. Yeah, but what can we do? All right, let's leave. I will look around. We must bring the murderer to justice. Okay. Let me have a look around. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. the game already told me about that. Um. Okay, let's have a look at this. Uh, okay. Yeah, probably belonged to our victim. Let's try to find other clues. Really? Couldn't figure that one out, lad. Scanner material, that's the woman. Somebody dumped her a few feet from here. The blood traces on the ground indicate she was dragged. Ah, look at that. That's the blue stuff. That's this green blue shit under her arm. No idea what it might be. She have her head bashed in? Is more of it around. Nasty blunt trauma, yeah. Looks like she was hit with a blunt object, possibly a hammer. Um, uh, there's another bit that I'm missing. Uh, is there anything? You shoot. Her heels had to touch the ground when the body was dragged. Okay. Investigation. Okay. Have a look at this. Relevant to the case. Okay. Custom extended wheelbase. Have you seen a vehicle like this around? Nah. But that narrows it down significantly. Good catch, Rob. Ah, blood. Question to witness. All right, fella. What did you see? Oh, I can help you find the guy who dumped the body here. I saw him, but you must accept the truth. Tell me what you know. Uh, it's as simple as it gets. Aliens did it. Aliens? I've been investigating them for years. They send rats to spy on me. They don't want me to show you this list. It's a list of aliens living in Detroit. All 37,617 of them. The murderer included. Most likely a van with a custom extended wheelbase. Does your list contain any information on such a vehicle? Jackpot! 
I've got a guy with a van that matches your description. I don't know his ID, but I know where you can find him. A film set near the courthouse. They're shooting a TV commercial and it's run by aliens, so it all makes sense. Casey must have discovered something there, and they got her. That must have been what's happened. Uh, what's the purpose of your list? What is the purpose of your list? It's my tool to spread the truth. I update it every month and add it to my newsletter. You should read it. It's free. You'll find out some stuff that you wouldn't see on TV. What's up with his lips? Do you see that inside his mouth? Take the moon landing, for example. Didn't happen. Why? Because the moon doesn't exist. First time hearing about it? That's why you need my newsletter. This guy's a fucking lunatic. You know, uh, do I really want to hear about the aliens? Um, no, you know what, no. Verify your statement. Nevertheless, I recommend you consult a psychiatrist at the earliest possible time. Exactly. Now, the set. Set, the set, the set, the set, the set. All right, lads, we're here. Excuse me, mister, you're going to have to move. What is happening here? Uh, they're shooting a TV commercial for Sunblock 5000. Oh, there his lips Night also do it. not seem an appropriate time for such practice. Yeah, they ran into some problems, and it's running later than expected. I swear, we're staying here until we finish, or you're doing it without me. Jerry, don't you think you're being unreasonable? You better find us another understudy so we can get this over with. Let him in. We don't want to hinder the work of law enforcement. Shkosh. Thank you. Hello, ma'am. I have reason to believe that someone from your crew is involved in a crime. We found a green-blue substance like your sunblock at the crime scene. The suspect was driving a van with a custom extended wheelbase. We use a lot of different vans, but I wouldn't know if they're the type you're looking for. In that case, I would like to look around. Actually, you could be of some use to me, too. I have a problem here, and its name is Jerry. Jerry Jenkins. I need a reason to cancel his contract, and I think you could find one for me. That does not sound like a task of a police officer. But it could be, though. I'm sure he's guilty of something. You just have to find out what it is. I can give you access to anything without a warrant. Uh... Your proposal may be considered punitive. I will hold anyone who breaks the law responsible. I believe that. Dig deep. I bet Mr. Big Shot doesn't have a clear conscience. Start with the computer. There's a list of vehicles allowed to park on set there. But... Look for something on Jenkins, too. Okay. Ah, uh, be, 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 be. You! I'm gonna have dirt on you in five minutes, maybe. Oh. Okay. So it seems like it's in there. Is that it? Might be it, I don't know. Uh, what is this? That is their stuff, the sunblock. Okay. Uh, do, 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 do you use computer? Okay. Uh, how does this work? Oh, right. It tells me. Um, uh, suspicious, suspicious message found. Um, uh, I'm not seeing too much there. Uh. Okay. Turn off. I don't know. All right, let's go talk to the dickhead. You. Don't give it a dirty look. I am looking for. Look, I'm busy. <laughs> but you know what? I I like your paint job. It would look nice on my new car. Can you leave me a card or something? How am I gonna find some dirty? I bet you're the murderer, man. I bet. Uh, what did I just say? I bet that guy to my right is the murderer. You. 
question him. Okay. Where the buddy? I got dirt on you now. The evidence I have gathered shows that you are connected to the investigation that I am conducting. So what? You were covered in sunblock. The perpetrator was someone with skin that seemed to be covered with sunblock. I saw the storyboard. You fit the description. Nice try, but I won't even touch that toxic goo. I've got it in the contract. I use body doubles for all the shots where I'm supposedly covered with it. Wait, that bitch sent you after me, didn't she? She's looking for a way to screw me over and hide her incompetence. You want to investigate something, then ask her about the guy she hired as the understudy. His face looks like a walking mugshot. On top of that, I bet he's the one who stole my ring. See what she has to say about him, pal. Okay, Jesus. Back and forth to this guy. I spoke with Jenkins. He mentioned that you hired a criminal. This individual may be the perpetrator I am looking for. You mean the understudy? Did Jenkins tell you that I hired him? He was the one who recommended him for the job. Don't believe me? Check the camera footage to see what good friends they are. Why hire the understudy? Why did you hire the understudy? Jenkins' contract says he will not use sunblock. And none of the professional understudies wanted to do it either. They all say it's toxic. So I had no choice. Jenkins brought a guy and said he could do the job. Uh, where is the understudy now? Where is the understudy now? I have no idea. And that's the whole point. We can't keep shooting because he's disappeared. I hope the guys in the hospital are worse. Because if he's not, I'll kill him myself. <laughs> it's a joke, of course. You understand jokes, don't you? I will verify the footage. Show me the footage. Check okay. the camera footage. Right, no problem. Who are you, pal? Your agent sent me. Special services. Pussies, man. I've got a place. Of course, Mr. Jenkins, I'll take- Take it and get lost! The smell of hard-boiled eggs mixing with this green shit makes me want to puke. Looking at your face doesn't help either. This guy's a dick. Like a proper one. You. You mentioned something about special services. Only the best in Detroit. I find that hard to believe. I've got just the girl for you. Her name's Casey. She's... No names. Huh. You, buddy. I'm gonna ask you some questions. Your understudy offered you the services of a prostitute. She was likely the prostitute who was killed. People offer me things all the time, but that doesn't mean I accept every one of them. Withholding information is a crime. Withholding information about illegal activity is also a crime. Ha! <laughs> if that's the case, I wouldn't be the only criminal in this goddamn business. You know what? Now that I think about it, why shouldn't I help the law enforcement of this here beautiful city? Where can I find the understudy? He works at a gas station nearby. But I don't think that's his main source of income. I am not done with you yet. Do not leave the city. Or the set. What damn, I have to go so far. Thank you. I will say this is actually pretty big for a demo. This is this was 36 gigs. Hello, kitty cat! Hi! Yeah, this is 36 gigs. Um huge for a demo. You think I'm playing the whole game? I don't even know how long I've been recording, but I know it's long enough. Ooh. Criminal. I have a warrant. Who's there? You have to help me, man. This shit is burning my skin. <laughs> You're under arrest. Sunblock is the least of your worries. Look, I know why you're here, but I'm innocent! I swear! You are being detained in connection with the murder of Casey Carmel. If you require medical attention, it will be given to you. I didn't do it! Jenkins!
Jenkins killed her! Jerry Jenkins! The guy from TV! You have to believe me! You will make your statement at the station. And you'll let Jenkins walk free! He's the one who killed Casey! They met here yesterday! Casey's body was covered in sunblock. The evidence points to you. I arranged the meeting, I admit, but I was gone when this happened. When I came back, she was already dead, and I decided to get rid of the body. Jenkins is the only one who could have done it. Why meet here? Why would Jenkins be meeting a prostitute here when there is a motel across the street? His agent got a hold of me and told me that the guy values his privacy. The money was good, and I was able to provide him with a discreet option. And Jenkins was happy with the arrangement. He was bitching at first, but when he saw Casey, he stopped being so picky. Why would Jenkins kill that woman? I don't know. I wasn't there. Are you stalling? She may have mentioned something about wanting to blackmail Jenkins, but I knocked the idea out of her head. At least I think I did. Why did you not go to the police? What would I say? That a famous celebrity killed a street prostitute in the back of my gas station. That's a bit much even for this city. Dumping that woman's body in a dumpster seemed like a better idea to you? It's not my fault that people would rather believe a guy from TV over me. I will verify your version of events, but you will still suffer the consequences of the actions you have taken. Hurry up, please! It burns! <laughs> okay. Um, okay, so this is the truck. Let's get to the gas station. Can I open this? Oh! Power up! Oh! Oh, there's a little bit of a stain right there. Um. What is that? Blood. Okay. Oh, more blood. And glasses. Uh, okay. There's a hammer. Oh, your head, her head was caved in. Hey. Whoa. What happened there? Why oh, do you get closer? Okay. Uh, camera lenses. Oh, hidden room. Mister, how do I get in the hidden room? Oh. Rip it. Yes. There's a camera. Play the footage. Okay, they're arguing. Then he got a hammer and just fucking whacked her. Oh. Arrest the celebrity. Alright, you're under arrest too, buddy. So, did you find anything? According to the evidence, Jenkins is guilty of the murder of Casey Carmel. I told you. However, you are guilty of concealing a crime and desecration of a corpse. I will call medical assistance. You will be taken in when your condition permits. Oh, okay. There he goes. Now, time to arrest a celebrity. Oh! I just saw this one I was walking by. I did that. Hello. Uh, music is a bit, you know, out of order. Oh, hang on. Let's let's do this first. Good evening. Are those two men bothering you? First, they harass my customers. 
Then they threatened to burn down my shop. You need to do something about it, officer. What do you want, cop? Can't we have a little bit of fun? We did nothing wrong. Uh. Do this. Your volume control seems to be broken. Leave it! That's Shut brand new! I've only stole... Get out of here! Thanks, officer. No problem. He said where the phone booths are. No. Uh, actually, let's have a look at the shop. Uh, there's a bit of ice cream. Not too bad. Um, anything in the back? I don't see nothing. Okay. Um, a few drinks. Um, hey, right, I hope you have a good evening. Now. Uh, I want to have a look around. So that phone is out of order, but is there any more around? I have to go rooting around the city. God damn it, man! It's getting colder. Now What's this? Don't have Stolen wallet. Nice. Uh, how was I supposed to know someone would steal our old tires? Climb up. Oh. Okay, that was weird. I, th I was waiting for an animation. Okay. Stuff here. Stolen stuff. Okay, let's climb back down. Yeah, that this is weird. The climbing mechanic. <sighs> keep, time to keep looking for phones. Time to go back to Relest. Relest. Arrest the celebrity. Time to do so much. God damn it. I can't let you in, Robo. They're in the middle of a shot. Well, this cannot wait. Yeah, it cannot. There's a murder. They say the 20 seconds in the California sunshine is too much these days. Ever since we lost the ozone layer. I have a solution for you if you are looking for some protection against that California sunshine. The hell? A stay in Detroit prison. Jerry Jenkins, you are under arrest for the murder of Casey Carmel. I seen you on TV. You're glitching again. Ah, it hurts. For fuck's sake, it hurts. All right. You happy? There was a murder under loose, and now there isn't. Um, sorry well, about your that's shot. A wrap. Oh, yeah, you're right. Okay. Phone booth. Phone booth. Phone booth. Phone booth. Oh. What's this about? Take it! Unauthorized painting. Jeez, I couldn't figure that one out. You've seen the mess of it. Oh, phone booth. Phone booth right here. Is there something interesting in that barrel? My sandwich fell in. Well, you've been dreaming of a hot meal, so here it is. Well, yeah, yeah. Nice toasty. Is this one working? Fuck. Oh. Hello, lads. H help, help. This... Rascal was trying to steal my cart. Look what he's done. Have I just wrecked your life savings? Tough shit, stinker. All right, lads, what's going on here? Antisocial behavior towards a fellow citizen can be classified as a crime. This cannot be tolerated. Take it. A lesson for the future. To save yourself the trouble. Clean up on the double. You can't do it. I was only messing. I could have just picked it all up. Hey, you tell him, robot man. What a fucking joke. You're a fucking joke. Harassing civilians. You okay, mister? I hope you are. Is this a phone booth? Please tell me this is working. Yes. Call the drug dealer. Is this Maurice? Listen, man, I'm really swamped with the laundry right now. 
So make it quick. Uh, too busy to earn some money. So you would not want to earn some money, would you? I don't. I mean, I do. I do want to earn money. But wait, your voice. You sound like a future happy customer. Fucking Robocop! You want to bust me? Why don't you do a better job of finding guys who vandalize phone booths? I'm losing customers because they can't find working payphone in this goddamn... What the fuck is it this time? Anybody home? Don't hide, Maurice. Just a friendly visit. You like to do laundry? You should try working at the laundromat instead of violating the basic rules. Robocop, you have to help me! The back of the red building by the supermarket! Apartment 6! There's some guys here! I think they mean business! Hurry! He's on the phone! Alright. Ah, you're in trouble, mister and other misters. Big trouble. You happy with your conversation? Any evidence? No, you're lucky. Um... I know he's over there, but I want to climb this very quickly. Actually, I'll put... Oh, that's a bit too close. Just in case. I'll climb that afterwards. Uh, I think this is the building. Uh, hello? Yes, it is. Okay. Perfect. One in. Right. Hello, everyone. Uh, ooh, stolen wallet. Okay. I think I'm doing a decent job out here. Um. I hear footsteps. If someone starts shooting again, make sure the kids hide under the bed. Oh, that's actually sad. Ooh, laundry. Um, hello. Ooh, wallet. Um, nuke. What's going on here? Nuke. Okay. Food? What is that? I don't know. Something. Phone. This is where he was. And more stuff? Yeah. Hang on. I'm getting shit, man. Oh. Uh, I'll leave this on. Okay. Ooh. There's so much. Okay, let's follow the footprints. Um, okay, let's scan this. Force of entry. Signs of forest entry, okay. It's going up the stairs. To the roof. Okay. Listen, guys. I'll never touch your stuff again. I swear. That's not why we're here. So what do you want? The money? I have your money. You only have half of it, and that's the problem. You're selling our product at half price. That makes my customers complain about my prices. It ain't nice, Maurice. Maybe you think that building a customer base by selling your product under its manufacturing costs is a good idea. Under what? But it's not. Such practices are spoiling the market. It's been proven time and time again that such action leads to a reduction of future demand, yours included. Antitrust laws are there for a reason. Shit, Maurice. All we want to say is that you violate the basic rules of the market with your predatory pricing. We can't just go along with that. It's unfair and unethical. Not to mention illegal. The fuck? You are under arrest. Come quietly, or this may be the last economics discussion you will ever have. Get him! All right, bro. This is the last discussion you're ever having. Bitch. 
Maurice, you're coming with me. Oh, that guy fell off the building. Oh, shit, man. Why did you do that? What am I going to sell now? There are serious charges against you, Maurice. However, you can hope for a reduced sentence if you reveal where these three dealers keep their drugs. Or I can jump into that pile of garbage below. A few bruises is better than jail. Do you know what the likelihood is of surviving that? I know the hood better than you do, cop. So try some different talk. Or I'll jump. Scooch is lucky for you. Even if you escape, so does out to get you. You will be safer in prison. I'm just calling Scooch. I was busy, but he doesn't get that. Doing laundry is important to me. It relaxes me. If you cooperate, you can get a job at the prison laundry. You mean... I eat and live for free? And I do what I like to do anyway? I, I, I feel like I won the lottery, man! I'll tell you where these jerks kept this stuff. But I have to have our deal in writing. Okay. Jesus. Okay. Oh, right, where is that? There is a ladder. Right. I'm just gonna climb this very quickly, see if there's anything. And then I'll if this doesn't lead to the same point, I'll go over to the main mission. You see that guy down there? He's an asshole. There's a few of them. Few people. Uh, is there anything up here? There is stolen shit. Was that you, mister? Whatever, okay. Let's go on down to the main mission. Okay, let's go on in. Enter the arcade. Oh, crap! Give me back my money, you piece of shit! Don't you cops ever get bored with harassing successful entrepreneurs? Hey! This shit is rigged! That's a serious accusation, kiddo. Someone might think I would allow such a legal activity in my high-class business. Which I do not. I get lost. You work for Soot. Tell me where to find him. You cops are giving me a stomach ulcer. Stop asking me about guys I don't know. Withholding information can lead to bigger trouble than a stomach ulcer. Look, I'm a busy man, so I'm going back to my office now. Why don't you join me there, and we'll talk. Oh, on second thought, you can't do that. Because you don't have a warrant, do you? Hmm. What a douchebag. Maybe I don't need a warrant. Exactly, just enter. Come back with a warrant, cop. Uh, you can use Robocop's vision to investigate objects or people to to find clues. Investigate objects. Uh, yeah, I've done that before. Why does the game keep repeating shit to me? All right. What you got? What's going on here? Irrelevant to the case, okay. Is there anything back here? No, okay. Is there anything over here? So... Uh... Do, 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 do. Ooh. Irrelevant, God fuck you. What about you? Oh, for some reason. Oh. Irrelevant. You. Have you witnessed the owner participating in any criminal activity? Are you kidding me? Half the things I've seen around here would be enough to put him behind bars for a decade. Let us hear your statement. No way, dude. He might be a douchebag. But if you lock him up, this place will get closed down and 
Where am I supposed to play hooky then? Uh, stay in school. Children should not skip school. It is important for them to attend every single class. I stopped listening after should. <laughs> You're an asshole, man. Right, let's go to this side. I didn't realize that there was more over here. I thought this was an exit. Okay, there's a question mark here. What's this? Oh! Irrelevant. What? Fuck you, anyways. Uh, is there something I'm missing? There's definitely something I'm missing here. Oh, what about the bathroom? Oh, I didn't know you had such amazing colors. And there's not one but two of you? From now on, I promise, I will cherish you more often. Oh, what's going on? Your body readings suggest substance misuse. Oh, man, a real life TJ laser? You are so incredibly shiny. I'm definitely getting more of this stuff. Who sold you drugs? I really shouldn't say, but you are my TV hero, so... All right, all right. Uh, all of the arcade staff will sell to you, as long as you got cash. Unfortunately, I'm broke, but I have a great idea. You, you could help me sneak into the basement to keep a huge stash of goodies down there. Drugs in the basement? I will take care of that. Would you really do that for me? Way to go, TJ! I'm not getting you drugs. Search warrant granted. Let's oh, shit, go. Shit, shit. Is that the ocean? <laughs> oh my god. Alright, mister. Open I have a search door. warrant. I have the warrant. Oopsie. I think I dropped my key somewhere. You'd have to break down this hardened door if you want to get in. Can I actually do that? Be a problem. Okay. God damn! Fuck this shit up. You okay? You alive? I have no idea. He could be dead for all I know. Hello. Surrender your weapons. All right, bro. Shouldn't have done that. Shouldn't have done that. Alright, bro. Eliminate the threats. Okay. Is that all of them? Might be one more around the corner. Actually, more than one. Oh, hi. Hi. Jesus. Ooh. Stuff. Say nuke or get lost. Um... There you go, you can read that. Oh, hello. Okay. Okay, there's one behind me. There you go. What the fuck? Oh, what's this? What's this? Oh, a chair. Where are you guys? Ah! Okay, I'm gonna have a quick look around and see if there's anything else that I missed. Yeah, more stuff. More stuff. Uh, cool. I, I think that's all. Everything. Okay. Perfect. Let's break down the door. All right, bro. Open the door, or you will regret it. Can't can a guy just sell drugs to kids without you harassing him every five minutes? Who, who am I hurting, huh? They all want it. Where do I find soot? Well, if that's the case. Shut it, bozo! Unless you want to end up in the ghost house like that cop's informant! And don't you dare open that door, I'll shoot you! Have it your way. Alright, we're opening the door. Come on, bro. Hello? I have evidence. Take that. Oh, he's dead. Shit. Right, this 
Uh, do, 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 do. You guys can read that as well. I don't really care. Uh, deduction level 2 required. Fuck you. Level 6 engineering? Hang on, what's my... Alright, uh, engineering. Uh... Let's do that. Save. Okay. Uh... Uh oh, the game froze. The game crashed. Alright, bro. What the fuck? Yes! Oh, I can grab people. Ah! Okay. I was planning to cut back to where I last was, but um, I guess I'll show you guys that. Alright. I'm gonna cut back to where I'm inves investigating. Holy shit! I took off their head by. D oh my god, I'm a menace. Okay, I'm back here. Um, I don't know what that's for. Uh, like, what the hell am I gonna find in here? Realistically, maybe something in his desk. Like, uh, oh, pictures. Let's have a look at these. Oh, notebook. Uh, you guys can read that. Right. And phone. Right. There we go. No recorded messages. That's fine. Uh, I can't have a look at that. I can't do that. Return to the streets. Okay. No problem. Alright, here we go. Okay. Herman, this is Reed. Mayor Kuzak just stormed into my office. Apparently, his niece's car has been stolen. Find it. This goes to the top of your priority list. You can start by asking about it at some of the local garages. For the record, it's a blue SUX 6000 registered to Melissa Kuzak. <laughs> Someone knocked out his teeth, including the gold one. He's asking if anyone found it. Um, uh, no, I have not. Hey, what is this? Parking. <gasps> oh, 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 ticket time. For some to learn how not to lose the track of time is to learn how not to lose their money. Shouldn't have. <gasps> oh, you scum. Hello. Citizen, I am ordering you to discontinue this deliberate act of vandalism. S screw you, man! Alright, bro. Brother. Oh, footprints, okay. Let's follow that. Yeah, wait, let's just at least do this. Um, okay. Shies, shies, size 10. Traces of paint. All right, buddy. I'm not stupid. So uh, what? What you gonna do? You you can't put me behind bars. I, I'm still a kid and only done it once. D just let me off with a warning, will ya? You. Oh, service or. Oh, ticket or. Community I service. I assign you 40 hours of community service. D doing what? Painting over the illegal graphics. Inspired the graffiti me, artist. I'll get to cap over tags of those assholes from the hood with police watching my back. Sweet. Okay. Where have I gone? A little bit closer to my objective. Okay. Uh, I need to go on the other side. Oh no, I can go through here. Nice. Hello, lad. 
There's a missing vehicle. Hey, I might be a little late filing my tax return, but sending a one-man army seems like an overreaction. I am here to investigate the theft of a blue SUX 6000 that belongs to Melissa Kuzak. Fancy car and fancy name. But I hardly ever get the pleasure of dealing with either. Do you have any information about the whereabouts of this vehicle? To be honest, I did some work on one of those cars recently. But I can assure you that it was not the one you're looking for. Do I have your permission to search the shop? I know what the world's like. But can a man go about his business without being harassed all the damn time? Uh, you have not been harassed I yet. I can come back with a warrant, but then I will not be knocking. You think that's going to scare me? This is Detroit, for God's sake. People try to threaten me nearly every day. I do not try. You know what? If you really think you'll find evidence of that SUX ever being here, then be my guest. No problem. What's this? Anything about it there? Relevant, okay. Perfect. What this? Level... Oh. What this? Irrelevant? Irrelevant, okay. Um, this, this is probably going to be irrelevant. Uh, irrelevant. Great. Batteries. Level... Oh my... Jesus. Uh, could be upstairs, maybe. What's this? Paper. Uh, okay, I'm not going to read that, but you guys can. Clue. Ben, you're lying to me. Arantia. I just want to... Okay, no, it's still a question mark. That's why I went to have a look at it. Ben? See, I told you, you'll find Jack all. Because there ain't nothing to be found. This place is legit. I need access to one of your lockers. I can't allow that. It's my worker's private possessions. You said your shop has nothing to hide. The locker you have in mind belongs to a boy named Scott. He works for me on and off. Huh? I have to admit, I had a tiny feeling he might have something to do with your case. I will open his locker for you, but I won't be held accountable for what's inside. Brother, I didn't That's say a name or anything. Go on, have a look. And what do you reckon? Is he your man? For the time being. Where is the suspect? You see, he hasn't turned up for work for some time. This morning, when two thugs swang by looking for him, I knew he must be in trouble. I've overheard him many times talking about a place where he does car jobs on the side. Give me the precise location. I can't tell you exactly where it is. All I know is that it's one of the garages near the local storage compartments. Tell me about Scott. Tell me why you think he is responsible. He's young, bright, and would like to rule the world. I get it. But nearly every month, he gets himself in trouble. It is not enough to make assumptions. I'm not a cop, but I've seen many things in my life. And where there's smoke, there's usually fire. Is he a temporary worker? You could say that. We fall out a lot because he brings a lot of hot stuff to the shop, and I'm not okay with it. And you let him come back. It's hard to make an honest living these days. That's why I understand his struggle, and I let him come back. Working here keeps him out of trouble. And to be frank, it's not easy to find such a good mechanic either. Why did you cover for him? I can't watch a decent kid like him get swallowed by this city. Don't look at me like that. Instead of giving him up, I was encouraging him to come clean. But a man can only try. All right, thank you, sir. That is all for now. Hey! Make sure no harm comes his way. He might have done some foolish things in the past, but he's a good kid, and he deserves another chance. A court of law will be the judge of that. Thank you, sir. Oh, right. Wait, where am I going? Oh, God damn, I have to go all the way around. Oh, who's there? Oh, it's only you. All right. 
Chill out, lad. Okay. So I'm pretty much here. Whew. Hello. Anyone here? Hello? Open this shit. Oh god. I messed up good. Hang on, I wanna see the other doors. I didn't know this door was here beforehand. Or this one. I'm just looking for evidence at this point. See if I can get a legal reason to arrest people. No, okay. Okay, go on. You're under arrest. You must be Scott. What did you do with the blue SUX 6000 that you stole? Hey, well, why would I have anything to do with that? I have found evidence in Ben's shop. You can't possibly help me. I don't want to cause any more trouble, especially for Ben. Admitting to a crime is the best course of action for any young offender. I can't go to Juvie. Who's going to fix this mess? My duty is to serve the public trust. Okay, okay. I admit. It was me who jacked the SUX. But he didn't leave me any choice. Who is he? I can't tell you. If he knew I gave him away, he'd take revenge on Ben. Oh god, it must uh -oh. be those thugs. We're dead. No one is going to save us. If they are criminals, then they are the ones who need saving. Yes, sir. You stay right uh -oh. there. Anybody home? Where are you, Scotty boy? Oh, shit. Daddy's home. Blast. Ah. Hello. Ah. All right. What's this? I just found this. No hard feelings. Oh. Uh. All right. That's for you guys. You did it. They didn't think that through. Maybe you can put an end to this after all. I am missing vital information in order to resolve this case. I'll tell you what you want. Just please, help me fix this screw-up. Where is the car now? Oh man, I'm sure it's still in their chop shop. It's a warehouse on the northeast side. The entrance is concealed, but I'm sure you'll find it. I'm no fighter, but if there is any other way, I would like to help. Maybe you need some more intel. Yes, who is responsible? What do you mean by him? It's Rex, from the local gang. I only did petty jobs for him mostly, but this time he made me steal that car. He said he wanted the SUX 6000 we were repairing at Ben's. When I said it was too hot, he slashed me with his knife. Why were you hiding? You saw those thugs. They were looking for me. They realized I tricked them. They wanted the SUX 6000 from Ben's shop, but I didn't want to get him into trouble, so I stole a different one. I doubt anyone would have given a shit, but word on the street is that it belongs to the mayor's niece. Any criminal matters should be reported to the police. I know. I just thought I could figure this out by myself. Ben was right from the start. I shouldn't have gone down this road. That is all for now. Proceeding to the vehicle's estimated location. You are calling for backup, aren't you? Negative. Threat calculation minimal. Hey. Let's go over to the uh, chop shop. Right, I'm here. Hello? Anyone need shooting? Because I've bullets for you. Right. Let's see what's in here. Ooh. Footprints. Plus you can see them. You literally see go halfway through the wall. On the way in, okay. Oh, look at that. Is that a button? Press the button. What's up, big man? They were waiting for me. They 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 knew I was coming. What the hell? What blew up? Dumbass. There's another one. There's another one. 
What's blow? What the fuck? There's more. There's more somewhere. Oh. Two skill points. Okay. Um, I didn't use the other one again. Okay, there we go. Uh, ooh, nice. Save. There's nice, decent stuff. Can I climb? No, I don't think so. Oh my god. <laughs> oh! Okay. Now it's not me. Hi. Oh my god, bro. What was that aim? What the fuck was that aim? Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm awful. Jesus Christ. I don't play enough shooters. I don't play enough. I don't play enough. Oh my god, there's so many explosions. There's another one here. I saw you. Where are you? Where do you go? There you are. God, I need to learn to aim, bro. I'm fucking awful. Um. Let's see if there's anything, any evidence I mean here. Uh, I don't see any at the moment. What's this? Oh, just a thing to blow up. Um, what's this? Level two. Oh my god. Fucking smack you. Okay. Let's go on over here. Oh, you poor man. He just took a shit and I fucking shot his brains out. Alright, I think that was last. And, oh. Open the paint booth. Okay. Oh, hold. Okay. There it is. That's the vehicle. Turn to the streets. No problem. And this could have been resolved without anyone having to die. And yes, look what it came to. Bodies. Where to leave? I can't believe you've actually done it! Do you think I could take that car back to the owner and say I'm sorry? Maybe she won't press charges. This car is now in police custody. Oh, please. I could really use a helping hand right now. Otherwise, I'm back in juvie. Uh, uh, it does seem like he deserves a second chance, honestly. Proceeding to secure the perimeter. Keys are in the ignition. Thank you so much. I promise I won't mess this up. All right, good. Look at that. No time. Go over there. Is there a shortcut? Please, that to be a shortcut. I think there is. Thank God. Sure. Fucking crazy. Hello. You want in a ghost house? Pick a boom, motherfuckers. Oh shit! It's a metal freak! Uh huh. You need to get some manners. Yep, your manners is a bullet in the brain. Oh god. 
Stop shooting me! Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. Yeah, I shot him and I'll shoot you too. Okay, I need to heal. There we go, he's dead. Ah. Oh. Can I go? Shut up. It's that metal freak. Hi. <laughs> Give me the AK. Yeah. I love this weapon. Hello. Hmm. You shot at me. Hello. I heard you. Probably one of you two, honestly. No. In the name of the law, sit down and stop fucking shooting at me. Ooh. Oh, grenade. Okay, okay, okay. There you are. Come on. Bitch. Uh, any evidence? Wait, what is this? Whoa! I just saw that stuff in the bottom right. What the hell? I guess I got a shield and like a stun grenade, flash grenade, something in the lines of that. Right this way. Fuck off. Um. Check over here. Okay, I saw this as well. Um, okay, we have to breach that. Okay, let's breach. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, that was a clean shot with a grenade. Oh, I thought that was one person up there. Hello, hello, hello. Anyone else? Okay, I need to heal. No, wrong button. God damn it. Um. Okay. I heard another person, but I don't know where they are. I heard him. Okay. Is he up? Down? I'm gonna assume he's down. I don't know where he is. Uh, okay. Oh, 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 God. No. Okay. Recharge. Oh. Breach. Dead. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, my God. My health. Right, breach. Right, perfect, perfect. Oh god, oh god. Okay, dead, dead, dead. Jesus! Fuck, that's a grenade! Move it! Where is it? There it is. Oh, I need healing. I need to find the healing. I don't want to go through there just yet. Okay. Perfect. I found the healing. Uh, Go upstairs a little bit. Um. Okay, there's nothing here. Right, through the door. Through the door. Oh, you can detach? Oh, that is so cool. All right. Open this fucking door. Are you the police informant? Do you know where I can find Soot? Uh, oh, man. All great questions. But uh, could you untie me first? They really outdid themselves with these knots. Talk. Hey, I, I don't know how you usually operate. 
But that type of information don't come free. Ah, uh, it is your civic duty to help. It is a privilege and a merit for civilians to assist the police in capturing wanted fugitives. Well said. Uh, what can I say? I'm a sucker when it comes to helping the cops. So, it seems that the new guy saw the punks attack on the TV station and decided to meet with Soot on their turf. The meeting is supposed to take place tonight during Soot's concert. Concert? I know. I'm not really a fan of his music myself. But that's not what those shows are really about. Why don't we, uh, get out of here, huh? Lewis. Okay. Soot is meeting the new guy tonight at the old slaughterhouse. Copy that. Pick Ooh. me up at the station. I'll grab my gear. By the way, I've got something for you, Murphy. They call me Pickles. Eh, <laughs> and you guessed it. There's a funny story behind that name. This one time, I saw Torchhead stealing a delivery truck. I went after them, hoping that a VCR would fall off the back of the truck, you know? But it turned out to be groceries. So they left it. I made a pretty penny that day selling pickles. We'll have a couple of groceries around if you want them. So you are an opportunist. Hey, I prefer street opportunists. You know what they say. Shut up, I don't want to listen. Ah, it's nice to be free again. Thanks, Tin Man. Hey, uh, did Briggs tip you off that I might be here? Officer Briggs? Yeah, he's my police go-to guy. Officer Briggs is missing. Missing? Shit. May our city have mercy on him. How do you know Briggs? How do you know Officer Briggs? Ah, uh, we go back a long way. He gave me a helping hand when I hit rock bottom. And I've been in his debt ever since. He even introduced me to his family. Great kid and wife, though. His missus don't seem very fond of me. You seem proficient in undertaking police tasks. Ever thought of making a living out of it? <laughs> oh, no. One thing you should know about me, I love cops, you know, law enforcement, laws, all of that. I think those are great ideas, but so is Nuke, and when I need it, I tend to forget about the other stuff. So, you know what they say, you can only serve one master. Do you think Briggs is in trouble? I really don't know. Last time I saw him, he was going to check a case of missing bodies. Sounded like a bogus lead, so I didn't press him. Funny enough, he always tells me to be careful when getting info. But the truth is, I'm not the one running around gangster's paradise dressed in blue. Need to go. Duty awaits. Yes. Uh, uh, about that, I've got a favor to ask. I know that Briggs is missing, but I've got something that belongs to him. He must have misplaced it the last time he visited my crib. And it's kind of weighing me down. What is it? It's his wristwatch. Now, I feel bad holding on to it. Could you please give it back to his family? This is stolen property, and you expect me to return it? Gee, that sounds bad when you say it like that, but... Still, you shouldn't let me hold on to expensive things. That's how I ended up in this situation in the first place. I will make sure they receive it from the repentant thief. Oh boy, you're a tough negotiator. But surely you don't mean now. I gotta chillax after all this. Now. We'll proceed with haste. Ah, oh, for God's sakes, man. As you command, Officer Steely. I get hey, shit done. Man. Over here. What? This is where Briggs lives. Okay. Let's get this over with. His watch is burning a hole in my pocket. Okay. Apartment 21. 21, 13. Oh man, my hands are sweaty. Are you going into a drug-related withdrawal? Do you require medical assistance? Uh, what? No, I'm just nervous. Me and Gail have a complicated relationship. 
She's good at reading people. And I'm the type of person that... Is it? Yep. Alright. Let's do this. Time to give back their watch. Robocop. Are you here about Mike? Yes. I am sorry to hear about your husband. Thank you. Oh, Gail. no, 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 no. This junkie is not coming inside. What else are you going to steal? Uh, funny you should say that. Wait. You need something to return. I can't stand him. I'm sure he has something to do with Mike being missing. Can I investigate? Are you any closer to finding my husband? We are still looking. Is there anything more that you could tell me about his disappearance? I've already reported what I know, but if you have any more questions, shoot. I heard that he was looking into reports of bodies going missing. An old lady approached him at the precinct and told him a sob story about how she couldn't afford to bury her husband. Can you believe that? Anyway, when she finally collected enough money and went back to the morgue, only to find that they had lost her husband's body, Mike went to check it out and never came back. Where was the last location that he was seen? I remember him telling me that he was leaving his jurisdiction, that that's where the leads were taking him. I tried to convince him not to go. It seemed dangerous, but he felt sorry for that old lady. He went against his own rules and me. He left angry because we'd been arguing. Do you remember the exact location? He never told me, but maybe it's in his files. Why do you think that Pickles is involved in your husband's disappearance? My husband's a good man. Sometimes too good for his own sake. He believes in second chances, even if someone doesn't deserve them. Like Pickles? That unappreciative asshole constantly gets himself into trouble. I mean, who's always there to get him out? You guessed it. Salt of the Earth, Mike. Pickles has a bad influence on my husband. I think I right. have everything I need for now. Knowing you're on the case makes me a little less anxious, Robocop. Now I just need to break it down for our son. He does not know? <laughs> I didn't know how to tell him. He's a smart kid, and I think he suspects something. Could you maybe tell him to come home? It's getting late, and the streets aren't safe these days. He normally dawdles, but having you tell him should <laughs> light a fire in his britches. I will make sure that he returns home, madam. Thank you. He's playing on the basketball court nearby with his friends. All right. Basketball court. You still out here, Pickles? There you are. That went pretty much as expected. We are not done. We're not? You still have that watch, do you not? There is someone who needs to learn what time it is. Yep. Is, is that a... I don't know what he was going to say. I don't have patience in either. Where's this basketball we court? We must get to the basketball court. That's just around the corner. Um, are we playing? What's that got to do with time? Is it like time to kick my ass? Oh. We are going just very to quickly. remind Gail's son that it is past right. curfew. Curfew time. Good evening, citizens. I need... Need what? Some spare parts? Hey, there's a mechanic up the road. Uh. We all have to obey the rules of the games we play. Unsportsmanlike conduct makes all players look bad. That's right, fool. That was a technical foul. I didn't know he's so delicate. What do you need? We're looking for a kid. His name's Daniel. He was playing here earlier. Why? Is it past his bedtime? It is. Yeah, I saw a couple of kids drawing with chalk they found lying around that crime scene over there. Thank you for the information. Congrats, guys. You just became police informants. It has its perks. You'll love it. Okay. I see a couple of drawings over there. 
Uh, oh wait, what's this? This was drawn not long ago. Thanks, Dad. All right, you guys can read that. Okay. Ah, there's more over there. You talking about that? Okay. Ned, will you hurry up? You jog like a little girl. Now hurry up. All right. Hello. Anyone here needs to go to bed because it's past their bedtime? Daniel, come on, kid. Where are you? You should be somewhere around. Uh. Okay. Clues, clues, clues. Oh, I'm a dumbass. What is this? Shoe print, size seven. That's gotta be his. Okay, I kind of expected to be in here. So I guess you have like a scanning thing in your eyes. Yes, it allows me to see things that are not there anymore. Oh, so it's kind of like new. Brother. Okay, let's have a look at this. They threw out the Ooh. chalk here. They must have found something. Ooh. Me and Big Sean Cup. What the fuck? Is that a firework or a gunshot? We better hurry. Yeah, 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 yeah. Shots fired, okay. You leave that teddy bear alone. What the hell's going on over there? Yo! Daniel! Oh no. It's the cops! I don't wanna go to jail for this shit! Is that a gun? Oh, you're in so much trouble, kid. No, it's not. Whoa! Oh. Young man! What the hell? You're lucky that tin man here doesn't have a real heart. He'd have a hole in it right about now. Sorry, sir. You will be once your dad hears about this. My dad's missing, so he can't tell me nothing. My mom said that he's out on an assignment, but I know the truth. He's not coming back. Why'd you say that? He's always been a stickler for following the rules. I guess that's why he's missing. Cops can't shoot without giving a warning, and someone got the drop on him. But that's not going to happen to me. I'm going to be the one that shoots first. That's why my friends say... Your friends are knuckleheads. If you listen to them, you're a knucklehead too. Come on. Sit down. We need to talk. Those friends of yours, they take the easy way out. You don't want to go down that road. It leads to a... Uh, dark, lonely place. Do you know why your dad is such a stickler for the rules? Because he's a chump. Because it's the right thing to do. It's not always easy to do the right thing. It takes strength. And you think my dad has that kind of strength? Are you kidding me? Your father has enough strength for the both of us. He even helped an ungrateful addict that he found in one of these buildings that smelled of rotting garbage, half dead and covered in vomit. And instead of writing him off, your father opened his home to him because that's the right thing to do. That's strength. Don't you think there's someone else who could use that kind of support now? Mom. See, you already know what to do. You can start by giving her this. She's looking for it. Is he going to arrest me? No, it's your first offense. So he'll let you off with a warning. Right? The law is the law. Right. Okay. It's late. 
Let's get you home. Well, you told my mom about the gun? No. She doesn't like me already. You're lucky, dude. Thanks for the help, Tin Man. I'll talk to you later. All right. All right. Hey, partner. What's the status on the old slaughterhouse? I don't know. I have to take care of something. We can go there soon. Sure thing. Pick me up at the station when you're done. Okay. No problem. Right, I'm almost at the car. Um, I do have got a skill point I want to use. Vitality is health. Okay, let's, I'll start upgrading that. Uh, save, okay. And let's get into the car. Time to go to the old slaughterhouse. Oh, it's the end of the demo. It's the end of the main quest. Oh, thank you for playing. Oh. That's cool. Okay. Uh, is there, like, a map? There is. Um. Where did I just come from? I just came from over here. Okay. Yeah, it's just a small portion of the map. Objectives. Can you tell me if there's anything else I'm missing? Failed objectives. Police work. Oh, shit. Okay. Whatever. That's fine. Uh, there's just this one, but I'm not too bothered. Uh, okay, cool. So that's the end of the demo. Um, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, uh, leave a like, subscribe. I'm gonna end the video looking at this putty cat. Cause look at this little guy. Look at this little guy. He's looking at his little paw. Oh, look at this little forehead change. Look at his forehead changing. All right. It's it's like losing its textures or something. I don't know. Anyways, um, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.